So James is having his protein drink and his blueberries and his salad. I'm having my salad with the blueberries. And James is going to talk a little bit about challengers. Oh my god. So, I, I haven't finished it yet. Uh, maybe you should finish it up tomorrow. But, uh, yeah. So you can it's, yeah, let me put this it this way Challengers is you're... challenging. <laughs> yeah. So I was watching in the back of the vehicle as Pauline drove down here. She drove very well. Mm -hmm. um, Just going to put um, that over top so it doesn't stay uh, so hot. And anyway, uh, I was watching. Do you want it. me to open this for you? Not right now, because okay. I, I kind of got my hands full. So I'll be able to handle that uh, eventually when it comes to that. Besides, we don't really have a lot of uh, different cup holders here. Yeah. These are big cup holders. I like that. You can put a big gulp in there and still have. Room. I know. We're really yeah. uh, loving this, uh, this, sort of thing. this van that James got. It's a used van, and it it's very fancy. But the reason that we were able to get it for such a reasonable price was because it's high mileage. You so bet, we're no. just hoping it lasts. We're hoping it's not high maintenance, just mm -hmm. high mileage. Anyway, challengers, it's challenging. Pauline was listening to it, and uh, you know, at least she found it boring, but not boring enough that you were drifting off. No. And it's, it's. I found it funny, unintentionally funny. I think, I hope. And um, she wasn't like splitting a gut while she's driving which isn't recommended for safety sake no but it was horrible i mean there's yeah. lots of um bad techno music like the kind of stuff that womp, people womp, play womp, in womp. and it all sounded like, the same maybe it was the same when they're doing aerobics or something mm -hmm. I don't know. um when that's not on then there's all the tennis oh oh yeah that's right Clump. it's so terrible Clump. and uh so then it was there not were a, a good soundtrack. A few this badly uh, simulated sex scenes. Mm. One where, where uh, the female tennis player uh, kind of um, seduces uh, the pairs, male pairs team, and she gets them both kissing her at the same time, and then she backs away and they're kissing each other and stuff like that. And this seemed to be a moment of discovery mm -hmm. for them, but. Uh, it just wasn't handled that well. I don't think any of them had great acting chops. No. I think they were picked for their tennis chops. Yeah, you said they looked like they were actually playing tennis. Well, especially her, but um, mm -hmm. um, I was surprised at how good an actor she was, but still, I wasn't expecting much. No, and um, it was a terrible movie. And, and the uh, major problem is, is two hours into it, it was still going. 202, right. the last I saw. Yeah. Right. So this is... How many more minutes of... 131 minutes long. So Okay, so nine more minutes. Um, you were almost done. Of suspense. But it was just awful. Pauline was apologizing to getting it out. For yeah, me. I, I saying, apologize. No, 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 I enjoyed it. I didn't get it many interesting things to watch. It was, it was so bad. Watch. Yeah, it was bad. It was hilarious. Mm -hmm. Just not rolling the aisles hilarious. No. That was, was Conan... Conan the Barbarian, my wife, not my wife, my brother, and mm -hmm. uh, a friend of mine watched in Toronto, and uh, it was these three guys from Lethbridge, Alberta. Mm -hmm. We trashed that movie. I feel almost guilty because there must have been some people in the audience who are real that wanted Arnold to watch Schwarzenegger it. fans. Yeah. But the thing is, it wasn't just us. Eventually, we had people from all around the theater trashing it. I wish we could have filmed that. It was. I gotta say, liberating. Liberating. It would have been a way better movie, a film of the people reacting to this piece of garbage coming out of Hollywood. Mm-hmm. Well, well, I do feel bad for the folks. Maybe, maybe when it came out on DVD or whatever video, maybe they were able to get it and enjoy it in uh, their guilty pleasure and the comfort of their home. Um, once I can remember being in a Woody Allen movie and there was a, a kid in high school, I think, at that point in time. He was with a couple of his friends down front and he kind of made a scene because they were making all sorts of jokes and stuff like that. No one was getting into it. I think it had been put to sleep by the Woody Allen movie. 
I don't know what it was called, curtains or something like that. It was mm -hmm. when he was trying to be serious. Mm. And uh, it was seriously short on Yeah, I don't know why he did that. Down. Yeah, I know. No. A lot of people downright comedy. Mm hmm And um, I happen to not do that. I tend to downright Serious drama. Most of the time, it's just useless. Man, this salad is hitting the spot. It's hitting the spot too. Do you hear, hear it at home? Clunk, clunk, clunk. Mm. It's very good. Mm -hmm. I'm seeing some people who just hit the trail. Mm -hmm. And I'm not seeing an ounce of fat. I'm mm -hmm. impressed. Yeah. Well, that's the thing. You do a hike like Akamina, you're not going to see a lot of tubby people. They might have just gone up the form Lake. I think I saw these folks going up mm -hmm. Akamina. They're just a little bit slower. Mm -hmm. But uh, you want to go at your pace, not anyone else's pace. Mm -hmm. But yeah, people are into serious hiking. Rarely are they seriously overweight. Yeah, I recognize that woman over there. Mm. I think she was saying they were going up. Mm. She's actually got a triple crown t-shirt. She does. Wow. Like, uh, I don't think she's my age, but... Mm-hmm. It's getting up there. But she'll keep on getting up there. Yeah, you know, mm -hmm. might live as long as my dad if she's careful in these hikes and mm -hmm. keeps the weight off. More power to her. Yeah, I'm mm -hmm. glad I did Akamina again. Well, if you finish up crimp crimp crimped lake. Crimp <laughs> lake. <laughs> yeah, I know it's too full of food. I'm a little hungrier than I thought. Mm. Um You'll get the triple crown for this year. I know, but I'll have to remember to actually try to get my t-shirt. <laughs> no, we were getting from two years ago. Mm -hmm. It's kind of sad. Because mm -hmm. you did it. Was it within a week or something like yeah, that? Yeah, that was awesome. Of time. Very impressive. Now some people try to do the three in one day. Yeah, yeah some people saying you can do. that there's 60 people who've done all three in one day. <laughs> But that's presumably over many years. Could be over 30 years, man. Hmm? To a year. What? 60 people have done it. But that could be over the period of 30 years. Oh, yes. Mm -hmm. Yeah. It might be the same people doing it over and over. Could be. I don't recommend awesome, running though. on uh, mountain. Well, pathways. do you have anything else to talk about? Well, I've just got uh, uh, challengers. Uh, Okay. Don't do this at home. Um, don't see it in a theater or whatever. Yeah. Don't bother. Yeah, because it's really bad. you got to have a twisted sense of humor like I have sometimes mm -hmm. to actually enjoy it. Mm 